Hey everyone, it's Kenji. Um, people who watch this channel know that I don't do a lot of promotion on here. I don't take ads or sponsorships, uh, but I am going to plug my own books today. So my first book is called The Food Lab. Uh, this book is my sort of food science book. It's about the science of home cooking. So this is the book I kind of wrote to myself as a young cook, the kind of book I wish I would have had when I was a young, when I was a young cook, uh, just starting out. So um, although it also, you know, I, I think a lot of professionals, a lot of experienced cooks will also find a lot of useful information in here. Um, so if you've ever wondered why you cook certain things a certain way, uh, about, wondered about certain techniques, wondered whether there were better ways to cook things, um, the answers are probably going to be in this book. Uh, about a thousand pages, hundreds of recipes. Um, it has thousands of reviews, uh, perfect five stars. It was, an, it was a New York Times bestseller. It won a James Beard Award. So um, a lot of people seem to enjoy this book. Uh, I certainly enjoyed writing it. Uh, my second book is The Wok. Uh, so this book is about the science and technique of cooking in a wok. So not just Chinese recipes, but a lot of Chinese American stuff as well. A lot of Japanese recipes, Thai recipes. Basically anything that you could cook in a wok is going to be in this book. Uh, it also talks a lot about the various techniques that you would use when cooking in a wok and how to get the most out of that sort of what I consider the most versatile tool in your kitchen that you can get for about 40 bucks. Uh, the book costs about the same as an actual wok does. So a very easy way to, um, easy gift to yourself or to friends or loved ones. Um, or even enemies that you want uh, to teach how to cook better so that they might be nicer people. My last book is called Every Night is Pizza Night. This is a children's book that I wrote with my illustrating partner, Gianna Ruggiero, who is wonderful. Um, it is about a girl aimed at four to nine year olds. It's about a girl who believes that pizza is the best food in the world and therefore no other foods are worth eating. Um, but she discovered sort of over the course of visiting her friends and neighbors in her neighborhood and in her building uh, that the idea of what is best is very different from person to person. Uh, and in fact, it might even change from context to context, from day to day. Uh, so it is a book about keeping an open mind, about learning from other people. Uh, so if you have a child that might be a picky eater, uh, this might be the book for them. Also, thousands of reviews, perfect five stars, New York Times bestseller, all those things. Um, so yeah, those are my three books. Uh, if you're gonna get them, you can get them, of course, anywhere where you normally buy your cookbooks, um, or any, anywhere where you normally buy your books, but I would suggest buying them from Book Larder, which is a local bookstore here in Seattle. Booklarder.com, you can order it there. They will ship to anywhere in the world. You'll be supporting a local bookstore, and on top of that, I personalize uh, and autograph every book that they send out. So if you want a book that is personalized to you, personalized to your friends, uh, it makes a great gift and I will do that. Uh, I go in there about once a month to sign books. If you do it by tomorrow, which is uh, November 15th, uh, they should ship and be to you in time for the holidays. So um, a wonderful way, one-stop place to get all your holiday shopping done if you have friends who like to cook or you have friends with little kids. Um, Booklarder.com. Com. And if you don't get it by tomorrow, uh, don't worry about it. I still go in and personalize them once a month, once a month so you will get them after the new year. All right, that is the extent of my... Uh, no, I'm, I'm going to do a little more self-promotion. I also... Um, have uh, another YouTube channel now called J. Kenji Lopez Maine. It is my alternate channel. Uh, on that channel, I talk about restaurants and foods I've enjoyed. So if you want to, uh, mostly in Seattle, so if you want to see me going around and eating stuff and telling you about good food, uh, that's my new channel, J. Kenji Lopez Maine. Um, I also have a Patreon account now, um, so you can you can follow me and support me there. Uh, people on Patreon get all of my stuff ad free. They get all of my stuff uh, oftentimes in advance. Uh, you get written recipes for all of my YouTube videos as well. Um, and I also prioritize responding to people there. So if you have questions you want to ask me directly, I can never get to every single question people ask me across all my platforms, but I do try to get to every single one on Patreon. So if you come join me on Patreon, you can chat with me and I will uh, try and answer all your cooking questions. All right, so that is now the extent of all my self promotion for the day. Um, I always feel uncomfortable doing this kind of stuff, but um, I hope you all have a really great rest of your day, a uh, really great rest of your week, a really great rest of your life. <laughs> um, and uh, yeah, guys, gals, non-binary pals, uh, happy cooking, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.